You all right, girls? Yeah. What happened? My shirt is too tight. My sandals are too tight. Your sandals are too tight? Okay. Are you going to loosen it up a little bit? Holiday? Yeah. Oh, are you excited? Yeah. You're excited? Yeah. Woo. What are we gonna do on holiday? We're gonna go on the aeroplane. On the aeroplane? Yeah. Italia, what are we gonna do on holiday? Um, go to bed. Go <laughs> to bed. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh, baby, are you excited? Huh? Are you excited? Yeah, man. Your first time to Gambia? Yeah, can't wait. Yeah. I just want to get out of this country, you know what I'm oh saying? Oh my gosh, so true. I know there's all this uh, pandemic crap, but I need a holiday. We just need to get out of here, basically. So yeah, I'm happy, man. I'm happy. What about you? Yeah, no, definitely. I I just need to get out of this country. I need a break. I think when we had two of our holidays cancelled, it was like, uh, like through the pandemic, two holidays cancelled. So this one, I was like, we have to go. Otherwise, we're gonna go knocking on Boris's door. Somebody's gonna feel my wrath. But we are on our way anyway, so. Um, Fingers crossed. We just need to get on the plane and land now, and then we'll be in paradise for two weeks. You ready for Christmas? Yeah. Good. What's your favourite part of Christmas? Uh, My favourite part of Christmas is the food. Because I get to. I get to eat a lot everything, of food everything. and then my belly gets big. <laughs> That's daddy pig. Daddy pig! Oh my gosh. That's a daddy pig, you know. <laughs> Dad is our chauffeur for today. How's everyone doing? Good, good, good. good. Hello, Harry. I'm sorry to go to the bank. Are they your friends? Nah, <laughs> just be polite to them and they'll be polite to you. you just oh, fair enough. <laughs> Last thing you want to do is argue with in this country. I do boss. I can tell you, you're looking, you know. You? <laughs> I'm good, I'm good, thank you. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. My name is Ernest. Yeah. You're right, Emmanuel. <laughs> this way, girls. We were asking Anaya what she wants to drink. Yeah. And Dad said, Do you want orange juice? She said, We need to come in. Auntie. Okay. <laughs> <It's> auntie. <laughs> <laughs> <It's probably easy. laughs> you know you guys are all related, isn't it? <laughs> I'm good, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Mom. 
market is over there. I'm good, man. Oh, okay, so they, they, the African uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Alright, man. Super. Uh, well, I want to go to the Okay. Um, I want to go to Are you enjoying your food? Yeah. Talia, how does it taste? Good. Good. First day, can be a man. Are you finding it? Lovely to be back here on the sea. First time here. Show you guys the beach. Look. Right now, trying to get on a port. Uh, I don't know if you guys can hear me. This is the port. Hi, hi, ma, ma. New, 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 new. You saying, bro? Once we start moving. Gambia here. But sometimes also they transport through Kasima. Because here is the shortest way to go to Kasima than you know going round. So most of them they come trying to cross here. Sometimes they spend a week here or three days or four days before they cross. They go to the other side. So we're actually walking to where Apparently the last slaves were kept before they left 
Sanju Island. So we're going in to see a little bit of heritage. So literally, once you pass through those gates over there, you get put on a mini ship and you get sent to the west, not back home. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> So in 2011, the government changed the island to the city island. But before it was called James Island by the British. And for the British, it was called St. Andrews Island by the Portuguese. So hope you understand. Like this is like uh, it's a way of restraining and like caving them. Mm. Like if they get someone who is a uh, rebellious or someone to complain, mm. so, so this is what they, they use this for. Mm. Mm. That's it. The island is all the way over there. Oh, that. Within the African, this century was abolished in Britain in 1807. So during the 400 years, they transport about 20 million people from West Africa. So out of that 20 million slaves, 6 million died. You saw how the island was disappeared by the sea of Only so this one left now in the middle. Only in the middle left now. So when they became them here, they can easily transport them from here to America. So when the ship comes, the slave ship, they put all the stuff inside the ship, like sardines. They pack them, like a sardines. This is why they put them here, and they scoop around here, like this. They lock them like this, and they can't move anywhere. And inside here, no sanitation, no proper toilet, nothing, just like animals. So this is why they pass the food and water from this window, and they can have air or oxygen, so that they cannot die easily. Because they close the door and they can only have food and water from here. Hey everyone, Merry Christmas. So today is actually Christmas day and I've been here maybe three days now. Um, when I tell you, I am shattered. Like the heat is draining me. And last night, Christmas Eve, I decided to go out with some friends and family. And yeah, I just had too much fun. And then at the end of the night, somebody decided to steal my phone. So I don't know which Grinch 
stole Christmas, but you know, you'll get what's coming to you. God will punish you. Hmm. Anyways, um, yes, yeah, so I don't really have a phone. It's been a bit of a struggle because I'm like, I wanted to post Merry Christmas, you know, like what am I gonna do? But you know, I'm managing to make it work and it's not a big deal. At the end of the day, Christmas is not about all the valuables that you have. It's not about, you know, how much things cost or what you have. It's, it's about who's around you. So to be honest with you, I'm happy that I'm here, I'm abroad, I'm with friends, I'm with family. And to be honest with you, like, I'm just here to enjoy myself. Um, but when I tell you my voice is kind of going, like it feels so coarse. Um, I've had a cup of tea and it's not really done anything for it. Um, but you know what, I'm gonna just keep drinking some Fanta, oh, by the way, Fanta, African Fanta in the bottle. Sweet, it's, it's not like that same Fanta that we have in the shops, like Fanta with no hacks. This one is sweet. So yeah, Fanta, all the other drinks, and you know what, I'm looking forward to some traditional Gambian meals, the Yassa, the Benachin, the Domada, everything, as well as like, you know, a few English um, sort of Christmas meals. But I'm looking forward to everything. I think I need to go and get ready, so um, yeah.